came from a very poor family. So um, I saw how my dad and my mom struggle throughout their life. And I uh, look at them, they're really good people, but I don't want to struggle for the rest of my life. So since young, I think about like how I can break up from the rat race. And then I realized this concept that is you can't work for money forever. You have to let your money work for you. And then that's when I started exploring. So I started reading books, talking to people. And one good thing is um, when I was very young, I started working when I was 14, part time. And there's a lot of older people that I know and they're always very willing to teach me. And that's when they started to teach me about the concept of investing, how I can make a dollar go to $10 and so on and so forth. I was very intrigued by the whole thing. It's just like planting a seed and then let the whole tree grow. And I like that concept. I, I started off investing in unit trust. But unit trust is like a portfolio of stocks. Why not do it yourself? Why pay someone commission? So eventually I started looking at blue chips because I'm very risk adverse. I look at dividend ale. Those that give me stable, high dividend, those, those are the stocks that I actually started investing in. Then eventually I got more comfortable as I built up like a stable, passive income kind of stocks and bonds and REITs that I hold on to. I decided to go more speculative into penny stocks. But 70% of my investments are buying and holding. So about 30%, um, I know I'm ready to lose them in case anything happened. That's when I actually... Um, buy and then when I see the price is right, I'll sell. So my financial goal, of course, is to retire very comfortably um, when I'm still young. So I actually hope to retire by the age of like 35 to 36. When I retire, I want to have a kid and stuff like that. So um, I actually plan on education, everything that's needed for them inside whatever passive income I'll need to have. When I started Super Life Co, of course I started because um, of my health reason. Eventually I decided to take a leap of faith, apart from passion, right? It's actually because I see that at the end of the day, it will be in line with generating um, good passive income for me. So financial priorities, of course, is building passive income. That to me, it's very important and not just passive income but stable and reliable passive income.